This morning when I woke up, the Lord very, very, just loud and said to me, my delay is not my denial. And I feel like there's a lot of people who need to hear that, that his delay is not his denial. And it brought me back to something that was happening this week. We, we built a fireplace. We, oh, we didn't build a fireplace. We built a fire in the fireplace, right? Because it was cold. And as I was adding wood to the fire, it was quickly, quickly catching. And I was like, wow, this, like we've done fires in the past, right? And I was like, wow, this is really catching. And the Lord said, it's because it's, it's fully dead. And I was like, what? Like it's fully died to itself. It stayed out. This was wood that we had actually moved from our previous home to this one. It set out for over seven years waiting to be used. And it quickened in my mind that a lot of times we get frustrated and mad with the wilderness season and the desert seasons that the Lord takes us through. But the reason he has us there is to fully die to that self so that when the time comes, we can be used for the purpose that he intends and at the moment that he intends. So his delay is not his denial. It's not his denial at all. And even then, sometimes when we're in the fire and we're burning, it can kind of start to settle. And sometimes the Lord just has to shift us just a little bit to get that to blaze, to go again. And it's that shifting that we don't always like because it's poking and it's prodding. But God says, just trust me in that. And I think sometimes in those wilderness times, it's easy for us to become frustrated and mad and say, I don't want to do this anymore. And people take themselves out of being used by God because they're not willing to submit to that process. So just know his delay is not his denial.